Welcome to Big Daddy Storytime. We're reading The World of Eric Carley, Short and Tall. Do you see the tall giraffe there and the short little mouse and their best friends and they're saying come along with me on this grand journey of finding short and tall things? Great job my friends and let's go in there and see. The rhinoceros is taller than the bird. Do you see the rhinoceros? And he's taller than the bird, but they're both great friends. Do you see that? Great job, my friends. The rhinoceros is shorter than the elephant. Do you see the short rhinoceros and the very tall elephant saying, Hey, it's okay. I know I'm a little taller, but we are best friends. Do you see that? Great job and excellent for seeing all that. The zebra is taller than the mouse. Do you see the zebra looking down at the, the, the mouse there saying, Hey, buddy, how you doing? And the, and the mouse saying, Good, how you doing, friend? And they're both getting along, talking, and saying, Keep coming along with us on this journey. I was seeing tall and, and stuff like that. Great job for spotting that, my friends. The zebra is shorter than the draft. And you see, how, you see the draft there, how tall he is? He's as tall as a tree. And the zebra is tall too, but not as tall as the draft. And, but they're both best friends, and they're part of nature. And they're saying, hey, how you doing, buddy? How you doing? Great job. And excellent about you spying that too, my friends. Great work. The squirrel is taller than the bird. Do you see the squirrel there with the acorn? And he's saying, hey, how you doing, little bird? It was great to see you again. And look what I found. I found a wonderful little acorn that I'm going to put away in my little storage spot. And they're best of friends in nature as well. Great job for spotting that, my friends. The squirrel is shorter than the rooster. Wow, do you see the colorful rooster there walking and saying, Hey, how you doing, little squirrel? Uh, it's a great day to be walking around and having a good time. And we're all, all in this together, aren't we? Yay! And they're so happy and wanting us to continue reading onward. Great job for spotting that. The flamingo is taller than the mouse. Do you see the flamingo there? And he's saying, Hey, little mouse, how you doing? And the, and the mouse goes, I'm doing great. How you doing? And they're all having a great time on this journey of learning. Great job for spotting that, my friends. The flamingo is shorter than the elephant. Do you see the flamingo down there? He's shorter than the elephant, yeah. But they're both best of friends. And they get to show us different sizes. Do you see that? The very tall elephant. And the flamingo down there, they're buds. Great job for spotting that. The camel is taller than the porcupine. Do you see the porcupine walking there by the camel, the camel and saying, Hey, how you doing, buddy? We're, look at, we're in nature together, and, it, and this is fun, isn't it? Learning new things. And he's going, yeah, it's fun, all right, porcupine. So great job for spotting all that, my friends. The camel is shorter than the giraffe. Do you see the camel there walking over the giraffe saying, Hey, giraffe, how you doing? I'm a little shorter than you. I know you're taller, but hey, we're buds. And isn't that great? And being, they're all happy talking and saying, Hey, our, uh, look, at we're sharing all of the tall and all that with our friends who's reading along with us. Yeah, great job for spying that, my friends. What have we learned today? We learned from Eric Carley that there are short and tall around us every day. Have fun learning about short and tall today, my friends. Be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more Big Daddy Storytime. Be blessed, my friends. Bye-bye.